My family didn't always get along, and I was at the age where I didn't want anything to do with my parents. It didn't help that my family had a new little sister. This is my little sister Amanda, and in 2005 she was diagnosed with cancer. That summer she had surgery and everything went well, except when she woke up she was paralyzed in her right leg. After a few weeks at Johns Hopkins Hospital, Amanda was transferred to Kennedy Krieger for rehab therapy, where she learned, relearned how to walk. Amanda had constant MRIs and in 2006, one showed a regrowth in her tumor, and immediately she began chemotherapy. Between all the travel to her chemo sessions and the stress put on our family, one would expect us to fall apart. Shockingly, this experience brought us closer than ever. We realized that we needed to trust that everything would get better and we needed to work together as a family in order for that to happen. This tragedy in my family brought us all closer together and was exactly what I needed to change into a new person. The main themes of all the stories told in class are trust and unity. Whether people trust in the right or wrong people, or if they're working together for good or bad reasons, these main themes still seem to show up in all of the stories told. For example, in beginnings, while many of the birds didn't trust in the little coot, all spirit did, and he was the one who was able to get the speck of mud to create the earth. Grandma Turtle gave her shell to All Spirit to carry the earth. All of the animals did their part in creating the earth. In the story of the visit, the maiden sent Ivan a letter, instructing him to behead the tutor if he truly loved her. Ivan was confused by what this message meant, but trusted the maiden and did as he was told. Later on, Ivan came across an old woman and worked with her in order to get his love for the maiden Zar back. In the story The Water of Life, the youngest brother trusts the strange voice of the troll and works with him in order to obtain the water of life for his father. In the story of the Kanu and the strangers, upon first arrival, the people of the village did not approve of the strangers, but the Kanu trusted them and gave them the difficult task of finding the village daughter. The strangers worked together to find her and achieve their goal by trusting each other's strengths and ability. Trust and unity are not only themes of a story, but they should also be themes to everyone's life. It was a theme for my life in helping my family through personal struggles. While it can be seen in a small scale, trust and unity are also the themes of a much more global scale. By using the themes of trust and unity in our lives, we can establish peace and justice for not only ourselves, but also for the world. If we work together, we can establish peace and justice, but in order to do so, we must trust that we can make it there.